Hello, my name is Blake Patterson, and welcome to Afro Reviews. On the latest episode of the classic series, I examined Bob Fosse's All That Jazz. After Lenny, Fosse decided to create a semi-autobiography about his interests and vices. Fosse's central character is Joe Gideon, played by the great Roy Scheider. Joe Gideon is one of those flawed characters who will either disgust or entertain audiences because of his misogyny and arrogance. I know people who do not like this movie because of how Gideon is. I, however, think all that jazz is an ingenious piece of filmmaking because Fosse is creative and personal. Fosse is honest about his wrongdoings, yet he executes some of these conflicts with grand set designs and musical numbers. As the film progresses, Fosse directs Gideon's daily routine frequently as he destructs towards his fate. There are also clever sequences when Gideon converses with an angel named Angelique. Angelique's creation and casting is unique because she is a beautiful woman who attracts Gideon and his impulses. However, Gideon realizes how being with her will result in his death. Fosse incorporates his real-life heart attack as a way of conveying his inevitable death. Despite the bleakness of the feature, there are a few wonderful and charming scenes with Gideon's daughter. Also, I should mention it is difficult to find this movie on a streaming service, but it is currently on Pluto TV. All That Jazz is one of the boldest and most electrifying musicals of all time, a close rival to Robert Altman's Nashville. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great night.